All right, in this video, I'm going to share with you the type of slingshot that King David was using. And uh, perhaps it was a little bit more powerful than we think. And it might even be an armor piercing slingshot. So if we look at Samuel chapter 17, verse 40, David arms himself and he took his staff in his hand and chose him five smooth stones out of the brook. And maybe I'll make a video about that as to why he picked five of them and not just one or two. And put them in a shepherd's bag, which he had even in a script, which is kind of important. And his sling was in his hand and he drew near to the Philistine. And the Philistine came near unto David and the man that bare the shield went before him. So he had a shield bearer. And these guys would be able to deflect anything. Spears, javelins, all kinds of stuff. So that was his purpose. And when the Philistine looked about and saw David, he disdained him. For he was but a youth and ruddy and a fair countenance. And the Philistine said unto David, Am I a dog that thou comest to me with staves? Plural. Plural. Which is interesting he didn't have one staff he had two and the philistine cursed david by his gods and the philistine said to david come to me and i will give thy flesh unto the fowls of the air and to the beasts of the earth and then king david says nope i'm gonna do the same thing and i'm gonna cut your head off and all this stuff so it came to pass when the Philistines rose and came and drew nigh to meet David, when the Philistine rose, that David hastened and ran toward the army to meet the Philistine. And David put his hand in his bag and took thence a stone and slang it and smote the Philistine in his forehead that the stone sunk into his forehead and he fell upon his faith to the face to the earth so david prevailed over the philistines with a sling and with a stone and smote the philistine and slew him and there was no sword in the hand of david and then david ran took the sword and you know the rest of the story so i believe that the type of slingshot that king david used was none other than a miniature trebuchet notice this here this little rough drawing here of a trebuchet it's basically a long beam that has pulley systems on it and it has a sling on it so like this here so back in king david's day shepherds were known to use this type of a system but it was on a staff so king david had a regular staff and then he also had another staff with this type of sling and he had five smooth stones these are armor piercing slingshots this isn't your average one that you see using in a hand but this is for long distance stuff as well so if david was close he would pierce saul's armor no problem with one of these shots because the armor wasn't that strong back in the day that's why um, Goliath had a armor bearer to almost like a double reinforcement to deflect javelins, spears, arrows, that kind of stuff so that Goliath can get close enough. So this is what I think King David had was a staff slingshot. And again, this was quite common to shepherds because they needed to be able to shoot long distances in case a bear or a lion or something were to approach. And these are like high powered rifles. Think of them that way. So I hope you got something out of this. If you have subscribed to this channel, feel free to share your comments. Let me know your thoughts. And uh, like I said, don't forget to subscribe. We are approaching 1000 subs. Bye for now.